Mino in the other. And Sorzy in Winner's Finals. Ridley? Yeah. I did not expect a Ridley. The Ridley. And you know what? I kind of don't blame him at this point because he does have kind of the Game & Watch Ike on lockdown. He knows a lot about it. So why not go to another character and see how you can fare? And who knows? Like, if, you, if you're going to confront that situation where you're going to play Ike multiple times, as well see True. what, what your mean, options are. Feel yourself out. Yeah, it's a good time to just look at the options. You're starting off. It's a best of five, so there's a lot of room. Yep. Just mix things up. Well, this is the best of five for loose quarters. Hmm. Just two big guys really at each other, really. Yep. That's all this matchup is going to be. Catches the yeah. normal getup. Splendid stuff right there. I, from I see so many people going for normal getup, but it's the one that gives you the less iframes, but the most exploitable one. Absolutely. Okay, the landing here. Oh my god, getting so much mileage on Ridley right now. Oh, definitely. I mean, Ridley with how big he is, he's just combo food right now, especially for a character like with Ike. I like Ike that has like so many confirms out of so many moves. Huh? One again, and that's just it with the kill power that this character has. Yeah, no, it's uh, almost as if Babino is absolutely automatic. You know? Getting everything, his extensions are on point, he's not dropping any bread and butter stuff. Getting the kills at the right percentages, everything's clicking. And right now, I think that rage also means that one or two strings and then the kill threat is there. So y'all really need to get might rid be of that it already, stuff. actually. Oh my oh, god. Oh yeah, you followed him so well there too. That's it. That's it. Absolutely nuts, Babino. Just opening with a three stock. I don't think we're seeing Ridley again. Yo, if that's what an I if that's what a Wi-Fi Ike is, I don't want to play against <laughs> Wi-Fi Ike, I'm gonna say it right now. Very good stuff by Babino there. Oh, Wi-Fi though, it's local. No, but that was his <laughs> <laughs> I'm so done with you today, man. I'm so done with this. Stock battle. <laughs> I swear, man. I can't escape. I have annoying on my right and obnoxious on my left. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. It's all love here. It's all love. We're just messing around. Yeah. Don't even know this. Trying something else again? Yeah, absolutely. Why not? Like, why not? And you know, maybe he wants to go have supper and go home. <laughs> maybe the, maybe they just, I don't know, play a lot. Like, I don't know. Off. I don't know that they play a lot, but. And maybe like the, the download has been done already for the matchup or something. Yeah, absolutely. Or, and you know, sometimes like when you feel really strongly about yourself or about your ability to win, you feel comfortable like dropping the two stock, the two win, I guess the, the two first games. And then you can just kind of, Okay, I'm putting myself in a reverse 3 situation. This is good practice. So far, good opening though coming from that Sephiroth. Yep. Sephiroth doesn't have the tools to, I think, work around Ike a bit better than Ridley does. Oh, definitely. And the fact that you're just more mobile and not as, uh, as bulky. But the one thing you need to remember is Sephiroth is extremely light. Extremely light. And normally with the one-winged the one -winged angel, They'll want to kind of stall in the air and use their jumps to have more air time. Ooh, Not speaking something. of that one wing angel coming in clutch here with the iframe. With iframes. the armor, yeah. It was really cute. Oh, yeah, I said iframe. Armor. So that'll work for sure. Yeah, I'll just holding on. Okay. Keep working. A little NC there with the mm -hmm. counter, but somehow still landed yeah. in. But now just at an 11 person move. Yeah, getting... So far, so good for the Yowl, though. Seth has been working wonders for him, but have no keeping on with his game plan. Definitely, I mean these two are just neck and neck right now, and it's uh, it's kind of what you'd expect from that matchup, really. Yeah. Just these two, these two with their giant sword. <laughs> Giant swords. Uh, generally oh, speaking. Okay. Whoop. Yeah, this is dead even. 
You know, both, both characters aren't really getting their, their short hop uh, bread and butter stuff. So, like, uh, neither Sephiroth or Ike are getting their landing theirs. So, neither of them is really going crazy. Ooh. Just as you say that. Just as you say that. Man, that was, uh, that was bold. They had to prove you wrong. <laughs> Absolutely bold right there. You love to see it. Well, okay. Fabino, though, when, oh. seemingly extending this lead and yeah. not looking like he's going to stop. Excellent parry. Pressure's on that's right now. It. Yeah, I, I even kind of questioned the DI there. I mean, that seems uh, so early, but at the same time, Seth is Seth. Man. Just it, is, it is Sephiroth getting hit by Ike. Like, that, that is what how you would expect. The DI had nothing to do there. Such a strong hitter. And we'll see here if we do get to see that game and watch or if you bring out another, get another character. Maybe you try again the Sephiroth. It, it yeah. started really well, but then at the end, it looked like yeah. uh, Bino just figured out something. And the thing too is, although I think Isla has potentially even stronger fundamentals than Babino. Let's remember, Babino's a character specialist. He's the one that hones the Ike and brings into every single matchup as much as he can. So for sure, there's moments where I feel like his bread and butter and the way that he's setting himself up, that extra knowledge is really getting him so much juice, so much damage, so much of the earlier kills. And Yao's kind of been looking for an answer with these different characters and then to really work out in his favor, He's going to go back to his game and watch. So we'll see if I mean, if, if he you, can pull the 3-0 here right back. If you gotta bring in everything, like of course I'm gonna go back to your main. So that's kind of what I, yeah. I expected here. Yeah, no surprises that uh, this is back. And another head bop in song actually right here. I'm really curious because again, game and watch. Like, just as heavy, if not, well, if not more than Sephiroth. Yeah. Uh, I mean, light. Like, yeah, just, <laughs> just maybe a bit lighter, yeah. Just, okay, I thought for a moment that he was just yeah. leaving himself high in there, and I was like... A big hold. difference, though, even though Sephiroth and Game & Watch share similar weights, their hurt box size is completely different. Exactly. Game & Watch is so much smaller. Yeah, definitely harder to hit him. And he has so many options, but he gets to read there. Get up. Okay. After everything I've seen Yell do, it, it kind of feels like it's going off right now. Mm -hmm. We're not seeing any of that momentum and, uh, or result yeah. that we were seeing earlier. He's playing super passively. Yeah, his... It, it, I don't know if it's... It almost looks like he's out of out of gas, man. Like, he kind of got himself gassed out in winners, and now he seems kind of just out of it. Yeah, that, that's really what it feels like. So unfortunate. Yeah, because he was he having was, a... Strong winner's bracket, and we were even thinking to ourselves that he's going to make it to winner's finals. And that's and just, that just that's it. a three stock. Good God. It's not the, the game that we were expecting to no, see. No, not at all. I, like, for having seen Aiza and Yael earlier in the bracket go so close in this matchup, mm -hmm. and Babino just completely blowing this out of proportion, completely out of... that that That's an impressive showing by Babino.